What's going on everyone? So today I'm doing story time number two. Uh, this is the attack, attack, <laughs> this is the attack. Yes, this is the attack. This is a story about the time that I got attacked by a sink. So back in, uh, it was junior year of high school and I was homesick. Not sick, I was actually sick uh, that day and uh, my parents uh, were both at work and anyway, so I was in the bathroom, went to wash my hands, and I mean, I barely turned uh, the knob on the faucet, barely turned it. And next thing I know, the knob goes flying off, water shooting in the air. And I'm just sitting here like a deer in the headlights, like, you know, like, I mean, just happened so fast. And then go, next thing I know, I'm going to wash my hands, and then there's, you know, water shooting in the air, and I'm, my brain's trying to process it. And so the first thing I grabbed, because first thing that's closest to me was a towel and so I grabbed a towel and just almost like try to stop it and then I'm like this isn't gonna work so then I had to um I had to call my dad I was like I'll just call my dad I, I gotta call dad so uh, I called him and I don't remember what the conversation was exactly like I'm sure I said something like yeah there's you know water shooting at the ceiling so what did I do so he he said well you're gonna have to turn the water off and of course I didn't know how to do that so he had to talk me uh, through that process and I did it but um after that experience I was I don't want to say traumatized I mean it wasn't but I was kind of I almost had like sink anxiety I, I kind of say it's like a short-term fear of sinks but I guess it's more of anxiety because anytime I would get around a sink I would definitely be you know kind of almost sizing up the sink you know like yeah you're not gonna get me I'm not, that's not gonna happen to me again you know what I'm saying so I don't know why I pointed but, but anyways I was like yeah you're not gonna get me again so anytime I'd go to that same you know faucet well we replaced that faucet of course but it was anytime I'd go to the faucet in the bathroom I'd be like stretched out you know at my and, and like this so that way it doesn't happen again because I'm sure I got uh, sprayed partly you know from that but it was Man, it was something else, um, for sure. One of the crazier things that I've experienced. So, like I say, I have that short-term fear or anxiety lasted about a week and a half or two. But every now and again, I think about that, and I'm like, man. And, and also, if you're wondering, like, well, why did that happen? I'm I guessing because we'd had that faucet for, I don't know, eight, nine years, whatever it was. So, had a long time, and I guess over time, it just somehow the knob came loose. Or, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know how that worked. Somehow... It uh, was loose and pow, like a rocket, like a rocket or something. Like seriously, just launched in the air. So uh, that was wild for sure. Surprised that the water didn't hit the light or anything. Of course, it's in a globe thingy or something, whatever it's in. So I guess it's protected. But I don't know. Crazy stuff, man. So that's probably one of the wilder things. I mean, I have other stories of dumb things, but that was just something that just kind of happened. Um, yeah, so I didn't really get attacked, but it just kind of happened, and that's why I say attacked by a sink. So, anyways, guys, I'll catch y'all later.